we will now call upon the chair of the Mechanical Engineering Department, Professor Faradan Delali, to introduce the class of 2021 valedictorian for the Grove School of Engineering. President Boudreau, Provost Liss, Dean Cousins, faculty colleagues, and the graduating class of 2021. It gives me great pleasure to introduce to you the Gross School of Engineering valedictorian of the class of 2021, Mr. Kandekar Shadman Habib. Introducing a valedictorian in general is not a difficult task. There are no mediocre GPAs to paper over. There are no F grades in the record to give lame excuses for, nor failures to dress up as successes. A valedictorian by definition is a successful graduate. But being successful alone does not make you a valedictorian. There is this undefined, elusive quality that distinguishes one graduate from other successful graduates that bestows the title of valedictorian. When the Grove School of Engineering PMB interviewed Shadman for the valedictorian selection, he was well-spoken. May I say too well-spoken sure of himself and exuded all the qualities of leadership and knowing one's purpose in life. He was impressive. Needless to say, Shadman's accomplishments are many and varied. A graduate of Stuyvesant High School, he has a GPA of 3.99. He's a Macaulay Honors Goldsmith Scholar and president of the student chapter of ASME, Society of Mechanic American Society of Mechanical Engineers. His association with the Zahn Center, internship at Verworks, a startup company, co-op experience at Carrier Corporation, and involvement in varied design and research projects during his studies have prepared him well to succeed in the real world. Shadman is also a person who realizes that giving back is a form of thank you to the society that has made his success possible. He has performed more than 300 hours of uh, of, uh, as a volunteer for the American Red Cross uh, he was a leftover cuisine uh, lead rescuer and delivered food to local churches and homeless shelters and worked as a volunteer for the Bowery Mission. With these accomplishments and admirable charitable works, it is with great pride that I introduce our ME graduate, Kandekar Chadman Habib, as the valedictorian of the Grove School of Engineering. Thank you, Professor Delala. That means a lot. Thank you. I want to start off by saying it is an incredible honor to be here as your valedictorian. When I look at Grove, I see a community where students from all backgrounds and walks of life come together to learn the fundamentals of their discipline and grow alongside one another. Over the last four years, I have been truly blessed to meet many amazing, hardworking, and motivated students. From being an apprentice at the Zahn Innovation Center on day one, to now being the president of the American Society of Mechanical Engineers Club, I have witnessed tremendous growth in myself and my fellow peers. I am extremely grateful to have led and inspired many of you during group projects, club career workshops, or simply over conversation in the lobby of Grove. While I may not have interacted with every single one of you, I know that we all have completed projects that have pushed the boundaries of what we know into the realm of what we don't. And in the process, exercising the element of engineering judgment, that is to question our solutions 
and think critically about results and how they apply to the real world. We've all balanced extremely heavy workloads with our extracurricular activities, personal lives, and family commitments. We've stayed up late nights numerous times to complete projects or study for exams. We've interned at startups, nonprofits, large companies, you name it. We've researched alongside our peers and faculty and made incredible breakthroughs in the process. Some of us worked part-time or even full-time to pay tuition for the chance to earn an engineering education. Some of us have struggled with personal hardships of extreme magnitude in order to make it here today. In any case, we learn through pushing ourselves beyond our limits and growing as a result. I'm extremely proud of each and every single one of you who is here today, ready to graduate and embark on the next step of your career. We have all been through a lot and our time at Grove is no exception. It has sharpened our minds and opened up opportunities, but above all, it has taught us how to learn. While our journey at Grove may come to a close today, we will all be continuously learning and growing, building on the skills we have learned here to make innovative contributions to our communities, no matter where we go. And while there may be many incredible moments awaiting each and every one of you down the road, there will also be moments where you will be challenged Moments where you might feel you have failed or have not performed to your expectations. Moments that seem so dark that you're in a tunnel underground with no path in sight, fighting hard not to lose hope and contemplating giving up. And I want to remind you that it is in these precise moments that you should remember all that you have accomplished here in Grove and in all the moments in your life previously. Remember the values of hard work and integrity that you've exercised here and all the people that have pushed you to be the person who you are at that very moment, whether it's family, friends, faculty, or anybody else. Failure truly is the greatest teacher. And by pushing through these hard moments, you can unlock more and more of your potential. You know, I'd say one of the most practical lessons I've learned here in Grove is that things never seem as bad the next day as they do in the current moment. Sometimes all it takes is a good night of sleep. Other times, just remember that with every failure comes an even greater success. I'd like to end with one of the biggest lessons that I've learned during my time here. And it is this, you are never on the same timeline as anyone else. As you grow older, make mistakes and overcome obstacles, you might see that your fellow peers make strides far beyond what you have. You may feel you are behind or aren't on track. You may hear negative comments from those you love about where your life's headed. I want you to keep in mind that you are right on time. And there's always light at the end of the tunnel, even if it's not the light you expected. And trust me, it's rarely ever the light you would have expected. As long as you view everything as a chance to learn and push past failure, I know every one of you will be successful beyond your wildest dreams, especially in the moment you least expect it. And with that, I would like to wish you all in the class of 2021 the very best of luck as you flip this page to begin writing the next chapter of your lives. Thank you. Shadman and Professor Delali. Mechanical engineering continues to make us so proud because of leaders and people like the both of you. I'm sure that this sense of pride is felt by the, all the members of the class of 2021 and their loved ones.